actually won! If it isn't little Gohan, you're looking fit as a fiddle. Yeah. Hey, where is everybody? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, they're out looking for someone. Someone? Yes, Launch. She's the young woman that used to live here. No one's heard from her in quite some time now. She left here and went after Tien, but I was starting. She might have gotten herself mixed up in the fight against the Saiyans. 
So I asked Krillin and the others to go out looking for her in the area where the fight took place. But, well... Did something happen? Possibly. I just saw a young... A lot like launch on a news report from West City. I'm waiting for Krillin and the others to get back so I can tell them to head there next. Oh, go there, if you like. Really? <laughs> That'd be great! You can't miss her. She's got full-bodied, curly blue hair. A real beauty. Her abs little to the imagination. I can still picture her tank top shorts. <laughs> Just thinking about her is getting up. Ahem, what else? Oh, yes, her personality. She's a very calm, sweet person. Calm, sweet. Got it. Okay, I'm off to find her. Keeper.
did my best. All right! I actually caught a fish! I'll do what I can. Do it. Did my best. All right, I actually caught a fish. But I can. Flying sure is convenient. Quit jerking me around. P please don't do this. <laughs> Blue hair, same outfit that Master Roshi describes, arguing with some people. You punks are messing with the wrong girl here. I said fork it over, so fork it over! You hear me? Well, it's just... What's going on? Guess I'm just gonna have to pump you rats full of lead then.
Are you all right? Oh, okay. Who the hell are you? You're pretty tough for a pint-sized punk. You kind of sort of remind me of Goku. Huh? Wait, my dad. Huh? You're Goku's kid? What? What the hell are you doing here? These bozos stole my map, and I'm trying to get it back. What? D did you really? Um, uh, well... All right, that's it. Keep this dumb act up and bam, you're gonna get it. Ah! I I'm sorry, I wasn't thinking. W wait, so you're not lunch? What? Jeez, I'm lunch. What? But I, I was told she has blue hair. It's complicated, kid. Now shut the hell up and give me the stupid... Um, d you can find it in your heart to forgive me? Screw you, before I send you packing myself. Ah! <laughs> Bunch of no-good chumps. Whatever, at least I got my map back. <laughs> sorry for butting in like that. Whatever, I'm over it. As long as I got this map, I figure out where he lives. He? He came over the place for his training. I've been chasing nothing but rumors till now. Uh, oh, I see. Now this time, I'm gonna make sure he falls in love with me. Hold on tight, buddy. I'm coming for you. Oh, well, there she goes. I guess I better head back and let Master Roshi know what happened. Thank you so much! What now?
Yes! But she ran off somewhere. Hmm? What are you talking about? Launch came back not too long ago. Huh? Oh, did someone call for me? What? Oh, you must be the boy Master Roshi's been talking about. You're go, right? It's a pleasure to meet you. Mom's Launch. Your Launch? But the woman I met before had blonde hair. Oh, uh, that's the other me. People tell me my personality changes whenever I sneeze. And my I guess. Oh, your personality changes? Hard to believe, right? I think it might be some sort of condition I have. That might actually be the best way to describe it. Ah, that's what I forgot to tell you earlier. Sorry about that. <laughs> I really hope the other me didn't cause you too much trouble. She can be a bit harsh sometimes. <laughs> uh, no. To see you here, since she said something about going to look for someone. Right. When I came to, I was near West City and I had no clue what was going on. And so I decided to come here. Uh, I see. Oh, I know. Why don't I cook something nice as a thank you for dealing with the other me? It's the least I could do. I've been wanting to try out a few recipes for a while now. Yes, I think that's a great eat together. Uh, okay.
Gohan, back already? Oh, Gohan, back already? That's so. If you have time before Bulma finishes her spaceship, you might be in. After a fierce down with the Saiyans, the Earth is safe once again. That safety hefty price. The Dragon Balls, only hope of bringing back those who had lost their lives, were gone. Thanks to what Vegeta said, however, Gohan and the others learned of more Dragon Balls on Kami's homeworld, planet Namek. After they had found Kami's old spaceship, Gohan and the others made preparations for their long, arduous trip What could she want to talk about? 
I guess I'd better head to Capsule Corporation to find out. Holding out for hope on Planet Namek. Maybe... Maybe the spaceship's ready for takeoff. She wanted to talk to me specifically. I'll be of much help, though. Just the person I was looking for. Huh? What's up, Bulma? We're gearing up to go to Namek, right? I'm working on the spaceship that's gonna get us there. But I'm short on parts. Oh, bummer. With Goku in the hospital practically mummified in bandages. You're the only one left for the job. Oh, no problem, Bulma. Leave it to me. That's the spirit. Here's what I need. Think you can handle that?
can handle the I think I can handle this.
Let's pick up the speed a little. Right? Uh, 
I think I can handle this. Another one. This looks to be everything. I'd better get these to boom. I think I can handle this. Huge Bulma's places. <laughs> Talk about speedy service. Does everything check out? <laughs> sure does. Great job. I'll have this up and running in no time. Thanks a bunch, Bulma. The spaceship is complete for takeoff. All right, Gohan, just let me know when you're ready to launch. We won't be back on Earth anytime soon, so make sure you've got everything you need. R right! So, you all set for the trip? I'll just perform a few final checks and make my way over to Kame House. You go ahead and meet up with Krillin and the others. With their preparations for the journey to Planet complete, everyone is gathered at Kame House. <laughs> What's with the hair? My mom thought I should look more presentable. You know, when meeting an entire alien race for the first time. Ah, uh, okay. Man, your mom sh strict. We're counting on you. Don't come back until you've found those Dragon Balls. On it. Bye, Grandpa. Bye, Mom. Write me every day, Gohan! All right, time for takeoff. Watch out, Planet Namek, here we come! Meanwhile, just as and the others left for Namek, but back and fully recovered from his fight on Earth, learned of his commander Frieza's absence. Freeze on his way to Planet Nemec with his most elite subordinates in tow. He was in search of the Dragon Balls that he learned of from Vegeta and the others on Earth. His goal? To wish for immortality. Vegeta hurriedly made his way to Nemec 
in an effort to catch Frieza and stop him. If Frieza is able to attain immortality, the universe is history. I'm not going to let that happen. Those Dragon Balls are mine! Meanwhile, 34 days after Bulma and the others left Earth, they finally arrived at their destination, Planet Namek. We did it! We actually made it to Planet Namek! Hmm, this place... Kind of reminds me of where Piccolo trained me, back on Earth. No use waiting around. Let's find those Dragon Balls. Oh, hey, check this out! I'm picking something up. No doubt about it. It's a Dragon Ball. You're right! Woohoo! <laughs> right. All right! All right! We found we one! Found we one. found one! Huh? Krillin, are you over there? Huh? Man, you're not kidding. It's massive, and it feels crazy strong! And there's something kind of evil about it, too. Uh, what's going on? There's nothing to freak out about. Besides, look at the reading I'm getting over there. The radar's picking up four Dragon Balls all in one spot. Uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's probably just some Namekians. We got nothing to be afraid of. <laughs> Level, they'll know we're here. He, yeah. It's Vegeta. Looks like it's just him. I am not letting you get your filthy hands on those Dragon Balls, Frieza. Yeah! Bulma, let the others know what's going on, and then head back to Earth. We'll stay here and gather the rest of the Dragon Balls. Gohan, sound good to you? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'll get a hold of Master Roshi and fill him in first. Once I'm back, I'll pick Goku up and bring him here. I should be back in about two months. Uh, right. Two months. What? Uh, another one? Hold the phone. What's another one of those things doing here? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what I want to know. We found it, Lord Frieza. Excellent work. Now only three remain out of my grasp. <laughs> and not to lose that Dodoria. It seems Vegeta is looking for the Dragon Balls as well. Yes, sir! A pardon, Lord Frieza. Kui has just intercepted Vegeta. Has I that was fast. In addition, uh, the power source earlier disappeared. I'll make my way to their location and invest. I should be able to identify them shortly. Very, but I'm more concerned about ridding myself of that traitor Vegeta. What a shame. Think him foolish enough to turn against me, let alone attempt to steal the Dragon Balls for himself. Kui should be on his way to dispose of Vegeta. Should be interesting. Those two are...
long hated each other. They are roughly equal in power, I believe. So I assume it'll take a fair bit of time. You're not going anywhere, Vegeta. I'm going to enjoy blowing you to pieces. Right. Make sure to let Goku and the others know. Thanks. All right, I'm heading back to Earth now. Good luck, you two. I'll be back with Goku as fast as I can. Huh? Krillin! Someone's coming! Huh? Is it the Saiyan? No. It's not the... It's someone weaker. Probably a Namekian. It should be right around... Huh? Look, what the hell is that? Oh, those aren't Namekians! Look like Namekians? Who the hell are they? Their power levels are a joke! They're nothing but... I guess it's just some Taurus, huh? Well, anyway, we got orders to annihilate everyone on the planet. Wouldn't be much fun if they got away. So let's take care of that spaceship of theirs. Sounds good to me! No! That starship! <laughs> Sucks to be them! Guess they were in the wrong place in time! Okay, go on. Feel free to let loose on these guys! They're nothing compared to you! Here goes! Right! Gohan! Nice going! There's no out this! Uh, Lord Frieza, it seems like those two power sources from before may warrant more of our attention. They raised their power levels almost and then vanished after defeating two of our scouts. That's strange. I highly doubt it's Vegeta's doing. Correct, my lord. Can't be Vegeta. The sources each have a power level of about 1,500. 1,500? Anything worthy of our concern, wouldn't you say? They do seem rather unruly. If you happen upon these two, eliminate them. Let us leave Vegeta's destruction to Queen. You hear that, Vegeta? That was a direct order from Lord Frieza. I finally get to kill- Don't make me queen. Do you actually think you can beat me? <laughs> Are you blind, Vegeta? Take a look at your scouter. You'll see my power level is leagues above yours.
<laughs> you must really have a death wish. Coming at me like this? <laughs> You've lost your edge, Vegeta. You don't stand a chance against me with a power level like that. <laughs> don't be disappointed. You're in treat. You see, I've managed to learn a little new trick during my time. <laughs> like what? How to run away? Like how to control my power. <sighs> No way! 90, 20, 21, 2000! <laughs> ah. oh. Oh. This must be some sort of error, but at my scout at Vegeta's coordinate, and it's showing a reading of more than 22,000. Did you say 1,000? That's an older model scouter, isn't it? Here, I'll get a more accurate reading with mine. Impossible! It can't be! Is my scouter broken? But it's a newer model! The reading's up to 24,000! <laughs> Are you saying his power level is even beyond ours now? <laughs> Die! We're supposed to be equal in power! I've grown stronger with each battle that I fought! The most recent one on Earth pushed me to the Don't think for a second that a pampered peon like you could ever be my equal! <laughs> 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 from before. That 24,000 reading, it was real. Oh, I don't believe it. He just took out Kui. I'm hardly surprised at this. How soon you forget, Vegeta is a highly experienced in every right. Not to mention foolish. <laughs> His error and so brazenly defying me. Lord Frieza! The scouter shows there are about ten direction. Very good. Let's hope they have what I'm looking for. The fifth Dragon Ball. Let's pay them a visit. from this place. We're sitting ducks out here. We should try to find maybe a cave or something. We'll try to figure something out. I'm, I'm sure the Namekians can help us fix our ship, right? I wish I could be optimistic.
There's gotta be a good place to hide somewhere around here. Um, they look really strong. Uh, I know I said not to fly, but boy, do I really... here it looks like it'll do the trick so how long do we have to stay in a creepy place like that huh Krillin do you sense that power over there uh, yeah I do it's not like the others from before this time it might be Namekian huh Hide! Some strange energy headed this way. What are you doing, Bulma? Hide! Those guys we beat up earlier weren't alone! Huh? It's them! and check the dragon radar, please? You said four of the Dragon Balls were in one spot, right? Well then, it's possible that those guys... Uh, yeah! That explains it! They have the four Dragon Balls! Yeah, that's what... Go on, did you feel it? Y yeah, their power was incredible! Whoa, Th that small guy, he, he might actually be stronger than Vegeta. Whoa, stronger than Vegeta? No way. <laughs> cool, man. Wait, how are we supposed to get the Dragon Balls from those guys? Once Master Roshi learned of the Nonamek from Bulma, he informed Goku way. Goku, who was eager to help his friends, then asked Dr. Briefs to build him a spaceship. Dr. Briefs modified the shived in child and gave it enough power planet Nemec in just six days. After bringing himself to fighting condition with some Sensu beans, Goku left for Planet Nemec. All right, I'm off. Gravity machine right away. After all, I've only got about six days to get stronger than Vegeta. Hey, you guys! Those creeps from before are heading straight for the Dragon Ball. Uh, hey, that's... Wait a minute. Th that's right back where Krillin thought that the Namekis... Okay, I'll head over there and check things out. I'm going too. Uh, wait a second! Huh? Are you just gonna leave me here by myself? Well, it'll be a lot safer for you here. Actually, you might be right. Fine. I'll just open up a capsule home here in the cave and wait for you guys. Go on. Make sure you lower your power as much as possible. Right. 
Freezer's horrible henchmen. So, you think there are really some Namekian villages here? Well, if they are, we need to hurry and find them before it's too late. Blasts are flying, right? That's right. We have to move undetected. I think I can let go. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Going on down, you look just like Kami and Piccolo. Ah, they the Mechian! I am Freeze for the Dragon Ball. And if I'm not mistaken, I do believe one of them can be found here. We we don't have anything like that. <laughs> it takes a great deal of courage to lie to me with a power level like yours. Uh, the, that device. That must be how they're able to find what few villages are spread across the planet. Oh, <laughs> you know the other elders were all too willing to provide me the information I need. W willing? That's impossible! Well, they did require some convincing. Zabon, show how persuasive we can be. Sir. Whoa. <laughs> Perhaps you understand now. If you insist on being this difficult, those young ones over there will be the next to die. <clears throat> They're monsters! How terrible! W what do you intend to do with the Dragon Balls? Why, I'll make a wish, of course. Nothing too extravagant, mind you. Just immortality. <sighs> Even if these monsters manage to gather the Dragon Balls, they still might not be able to make their wish. I, I suppose we have no choice, but promise me one thing. Promise me you won't lay a hand on the children. Of course. Mind you, you could have saved yourself all this trouble by doing this sooner. No. Take this and be gone. Well, I have you. Perhaps you can tell me something. Say, the location of the two remaining Dragon Balls. If memory serves, you need seven of them to make a wish, isn't that right? Don't be ridiculous. We Demechians are not in the business of endangering our own kind. And just when I thought you were less foolish than... I suppose I have no other recourse but to kill you and the children. Get out of here, Dende! No! Right! Ha! 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 No! Our scouters! Now you won't be able to hunt us down anymore! You're all dead! <laughs> it's not much fun killing small fry like you. But you gotta die sooner or later. <laughs> what? Who the hell are you? I'm gonna make you pay for what you did! Hey, go 
one. Even if we take them together, these guys are way out of our league. Your chance to on. Solar flare! No way! to Bulma fast. Hey, can you fly? Oh, uh, um, yes. T thank you for saving me. So, um, what's your name? I I'm Dende. Hmm? One of Frieza's goons is on the move. Energy. Is that the Doria? This is perfect. I can more than handle him all by myself. <laughs> Taking on Frieza now would be downright suicidal. I have to plan my next moves carefully. Vegeta! Hey there! It's been quite some time, Dodoria. I've waited for you to foolishly leave Frieza aside. Knocking you around should be easy enough without Frieza here. You think you're hot stuff, don't you? Do yourself a favor. Shut up and just hand over that scouter of yours. Do that and I'll let you live just this once. <laughs> Is that so? You went completely radio silent during on the Namekian village, which can obviously mean only one thing. 
You've lost every single one of your scouters, haven't you? Ha <laughs> ha Now I'm over there unnoticed. You want this, don't you? I guess you're not as dumb as you look, Vegeta. <laughs> What are you doing? Why did you break it? You idiot! Don't you realize you're not going to be able to find the Namekians without it? I recently spent some time on a planet called Earth. Believe it or not, they don't require scouters in order to sense power. There was another Saiyan there as well, and he also knew how to use that technique. Which meat life should easily master it. That then isn't it? Those little runts I was after, they were Earthlings. What are you doing, teaming up with those punks? What Earthlings? What the hell are you talking about? There's no way Earth would be out here. Enough of this nonsense. Stop wasting time and come at me already. I see what's going on here. You've come to realize just how much stronger I've gotten, and now you're too afraid to beat me. You saw my power level on your scouter before, didn't you? Number wasn't accurate. My scouter was busted. What are you so afraid of? Go on, try and attack me! Who do you think you are? You're not better than me! If you think... I believe it! Damn it, God! Let me go! I'll let you in on a secret! 
But it ain't so little. It's a big one. It's about the home of your people. It's about planet Vegeta. What? What is it? Spit it out. You... How planet Vegeta was destroyed by some huge meteor, right? But that's not the truth. What happened is a bunch of crazy strong Saiyans like yourself started cropping up all over the place. And the more powerful they got, the more they didn't see the point in following orders from anybody. Lord Frieza lost trust in you guys, and because of that, he felt he needed to lay down the law. And oh, did he. Lord Frieza ended up not just a st but every single Saiyan himself. But you know, Vegeta, you should be grateful. Lord Frieza saw a lot of potential in you, too much to waste. So he made sure to destroy the planet when you weren't there. <laughs> I bet that was a lot to take in, huh? You're wrong about that, Dodoria. I couldn't care less about my planet, my, my parents. But... What infuriates me to no end is how I let myself be used all this time by bastards like you! Thinking about it makes me sick to my stomach! <laughs> you blood freezer! Freezer's terrified of the limitless potential of a Saiyan's power. Gouter is to be believed then all seven Dragon Balls are needed in order to make a wish come true. First, I'll get my hands on the two remaining Dragon Balls. No, one should be more than sufficient. If I can hide even just one of them, Frieza and his lackeys won't be able to make their wish a reality. Ha! Then all I have to do just wait until their guard is down and steal the rest of them. <sighs> We're finally back. Well, you guys certainly took your time, didn't you? <laughs> uh, took your time. <laughs> huh? Pockets Piccolo. Same little. Yes, Dende. Has it been through a lot? Oh, yeah, that's right. I've got great news from my dad. Really? That's great. Goku's on his way here as we speak. He should arrive in about mm, six days. And I hear he's toughening himself up. M my, my dad's coming? Hooray! Six days remained until Goku would arrive on planet Nemec. Can you hear me, Goku? Wait. Huh? Where are you? I space? Oh, that's right! You're heading to Namek. Could not find it. Wait a minute. You mean you don't know what's going There's some crazy stuff going down. Crazy stuff? Well, we can talk about that later. I've actually got some guests here with me. In fact, it's for people you know quite well. Wait, Wait you don't mean... Train them even harder than I trained you! Hey, you hear me? I met up with Kami in the world, and he told the place. You said there's four of them there, right? So that's Yamcha, Tien... Wait, is Piccolo there too? Huh, 
I'm not about to let you be the only one that gets stronger in all of this. Tatsu's here with us too. Kami pulled some strings and let us have our bodies back so we can train here. Pretty cool of him, huh? That's awesome! Glad to hear it! <laughs> I'm doing a bit of training myself on the way to Namek. I had my spaceship customized to simulate 100 times gravity for some extra intense training. But if I don't get stronger in the next five days, I'm gonna be in some pretty big trouble. You mentioned that before. What exactly is going to happen? What? What? Whoa, hold on. You mean there's someone out there that's stronger than Vegeta? Wait, you're not talking about Frieza, are you? Beats me. I didn't hear anything about a Frieza. You know him, King Kai? L listen, Goku. If it's actually Frieza, then stay far away from him! Get on his eye and you're begging for trouble! I'm telling you, not just for your own safety, but for the safety of Earth, Namek, and every other planet in the universe! Is, is, is he really that strong? I kinda wanna meet him now. Do not go anywhere near him! You hear me? I'm looking for some sort of elder. I'm here to retrieve the Dragon Ball. <laughs> Battle for the Dragon Ball. of energy just started disappearing. Really? M more Namekians are being killed! And the one doing the killing has a very familiar energy. Uh, it's Vegeta! Now it's not just Frieza we gotta worry about wishing for immortality, but Vegeta too! If we can find one of the Dragon Balls and hide it, Neither of them will be able to make their wish. But... but they'll just continue killing Namekians until they find all the Dragon Balls! N no but Who are you people? Where did you come from? And how do you know about the Dragon Balls? Please, if you can, save my people! Yeah, about that. Well, if you already know, I think... I think I understand what's going on now. Come on, follow me. I'll take you to see Grand Elder Guru. Huh? Uh... Grand Elder Guru? Why are we headed there? Those monsters that attacked our villages already have four Dragon Balls. Not only that, didn't you say that there are more people being killed over there? Uh, yeah, I think I know who did it. Vegeta. Th their energy... it's all gone! There's no one left! Th then... Then that means there aren't many Namekians left on this planet. Ugh. Oh, man. Even if we find the Dragon Ball in the village that Vegeta attacked, that still leaves one! Wait, does Grand Elder Guru have the last Dragon Ball? Y yes Not good! If Vegeta reaches him before us, he'll get his hands on the seventh Dragon Ball! We have to hurry and let Guru know! Dende, Gohan and Bulma, you two wait here. 
There's no point in all of us going, okay? R right. Be careful, you guys! <laughs> so this must be a Dragon Ball. Fascinating. It must be kept safe. Time to hide it. No one could possibly find it as long as it remains at the bottom of this lake. If it's true that Frieza and his worms have five, that means just one is left out there. <laughs> this power. It's Zarbon. I'm sure of it. <laughs> it would appear that he's finally off that leash of his. He'll be joining Dodoria soon enough. We wouldn't have to split up and find the villagers if we just had our scouters. Well, look at that! If it isn't Zarbon! You know, I ran into your friend Dodoria earlier. He's super dead. And soon you will be. What? You beat Dodoria? So that's why he never came back. I can't believe this. I hear you've lost all your precious scouters and had to split up to look for Namekian villages. Which can only mean Frieza's holding on to the Dragon Balls you obtained so far. Damn you. Frieza will not get his dirty hands on all of them. I'll make sure of it. I've already found one myself, and the others are as good as mine. What? As long as I can attain immortality, Razor is dead. Fool, immortality will be enough to get a lord fight. The man is a god of great power. You don't do you? Lord Freezer's power is beyond anything you could ever imagine. You couldn't lay a finger on me! <laughs> You've improved. I'll give you that much at least. But you don't seem to realize the mistake you've just made. You have awakened my true power. You've got quite a sense of humor. Go on, show me your power! You are going to regret this, Vegeta. Prepare to be amazed by my glorious transformation! <laughs> Damn you! You must feel...
Pretty foolish. You went to all that trouble to grow stronger, and for what? Nothing. And here's something else you probably didn't know. Lord Frieza also hides his true power behind transformations. But... <clears throat> oh, he passed out. I'm afraid I can't let you die just yet. I still have a lot to ask you. I can't believe I'm actually providing aid to a traitor like you. Once you're fully conscious, you're going to tell me where you've hidden the Dragon Ball. There it is! That's Guru's house! That's it? Hey, Nail! You're okay! I'm glad to see you're safe, Dende. Grand Elder Guru is aware. You two may enter. Grand Elder Guru will see you now. Uh, he's huge! Welcome, young Earthling. I understand I have you to thank for saving my little Dende here. My gratitude. Uh, well, I really didn't do much. It pains me that most of my children on this planet have fallen victim to such vile invaders. I had no idea the Dragon Balls, the very symbols of Namekian wisdom and power, could cause such strife. Uh, Chase, but do you think I could borrow the one that you got right there? Look, I won't let the bad guys get their hands on it. I promise! I'd like him to have it as well. If the Earthlings get the Dragon Balls, they can wish for theirs to return to Earth. What? what There are Dragon Balls on Earth as well. Is or was there a Namekian there? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember one coming to Earth in order to flee some sort of crisis here on Namek. It must cut us, child. Truthfully, I'm surprised the child was able to survive the journey. If memory serves me, he was a member of the Dragon Clan, the creators of the Dragon Balls. But how is it he met his end? Did he die of natural causes, or was he killed? He was killed by someone here on Namek, a Saiyan named Vegeta. Young Earthling, please step forward. I would like to look into your past. My past? My, my goodness, he split himself in two to combat the evil in his own heart? How foolish. To reduce such extraordinary potential is such a waste. If he had remained as one, he might not have met with such a horrible fate. As me and Piccolo reach, either you're in order, and that you have exhibited great bravery thus far. I will entrust this Dragon Ball to you. However, you might not be able to make your wish. Uh, what do you mean? Unfortunately, I am not long for this world. I have perhaps only a few days left. Do you think you can reclaim the remaining Dragon Balls from those horrible fiends? As strong as you are, I fear that might prove impossible. Once I am gone, the Dragon Balls will cease to exist. Uh, I see. Well, I guess we'll just have to do what we can. I'll keep the Dragon Ball, and I'll guard it with my life. I appreciate it. I must say, you seem to possess a great deal of strength for an Earthling. But much of it lies dormant and unrealized. How unfortunate. 
Allow me to release the power resting deep inside you. Wh what are you talking about? There's no way I'm hiding any more power. I mean, I'm already pushing myself to the limit. <laughs> <laughs> Where did all this power come from? Yeah! I've never felt this kind of power before! This is incredible! Wait. Uh, would it be okay if I brought a friend of mine here to see you? I bet he's got more untapped power than me hidden inside of him. Yes, please bring him here. We could use another act for justice. Okay, I'll be right back with him. Now, wait here, Dinde. I'm gonna go get Gohan, okay? Uh, all right. Be careful. According to the radar, the Dragon Ball over there is on the move! It's heading straight for us! Do you... do you think it's Krillin on his way back? I bet it is! But... um... what about this one? These five here are probably the ones that Frieza guy has. And hey, here's this one all by its lonesome! Wait... That's the village we heard Vegeta was attacking, right? But Vegeta isn't there. I don't sense his energy anywhere near it. Oh, I think I get it. He attacked the village, but he didn't find the Dragon Ball. Let me borrow the radar, Bulma. We'll find that Dragon Ball. Okay, here we go. Hey! Actually... Thank you so much! Hurt my t I'm not sensing G in the area. That's good.
Right around here. Oh, this is awful. The village is in ruins. Got to find that Dragon Ball. my best. My best. All right, I actually caught a fish. I'll do what I can. my best all right I actually caught a fish place like that. Maybe the villagers were in a rush to hide it. What? What was that explosion just now? Oh, it can't be.
He's not in the recuperation tank. <sighs> Damn that Vegeta. Where could he be? Find him, Zabon! Find him now! Aha! The Dragon Balls! Looks like five of them are here. And I can't leave this place without all five of them. Looks like time isn't on my side either. Great. I'm going to have to buy myself some time here. Ha! <laughs> Now it's my turn! No, that filthy Saiyan monkey! Vegeta appears to... No, the Dragon Balls! Damn that Vegeta! This is inexcusable! You will scour this entire planet and find that traitor! After one hour's time, you do not return to me with Vegeta. Know that your death will be a slow and painful one! Oh, yes, sir. It pains me to say, but it appears Saiyans are capable of more than I initially thought. They seem to grow stronger with each battle they manage to survive. They can't hope to reach my superior level, of course. Still, it might prove prudent to finally rid myself of them once and for all. It would be quite bothersome if I had to deal with a Super Saiyan. It seems it may be time to call the Ginyu Force. <laughs> Here they are. Yes, I'm untouchable! This is what you get, Frieza! Your Dragon Balls are finally mine! Now that I have these and the one that I hid underwater that leaves just one left, then I'll have all seven! <gasps> This huge power is that zone. This was great! I had no idea I had this kind of power! Man, I bet Gohan's gonna get way stronger than me when he meets Guru! The little runt from Earth! Why is he on Namek? It's Dragon Ball as well! <laughs> <laughs> Seems fortune is smiling quite fit truly today. Oh, damn that Vegeta. Where did he go? Oh, if I don't find him soon, Lord Freezer will have my head. Wait, that. Oh, I've finally found you, Vegeta! A huge power level is on its way here! I guess it found me. Good! Once I get that Dragon Ball off the pike sized Earthling, I'll finish him off once and for all! Zarbon's probably quite full of himself after the last encounter.
Which means his guard should be down. One thing at a time. First, I have to get my hands on that Dragon Ball. <laughs> Zarbon is as good as dead! Krillin! Bulma, I told you to hide! It's not safe for you! Is that a Dragon Ball? Wow, those things are huge here. Yeah, I got it from Guru. He's a remarkable person. Yeah, that's right. Where's Gohan? I want to take him to see Guru to increase his power level. He left to go look for the other Dragon Ball. The radar showed one in the village Vegeta attacked before. What? Really? What the this power? No way! Vegeta! You're a long way from home, Earthling. Oh no, I was so focused on my increase in power that I didn't notice him. He's not wearing a scouter. And that means he must have learned how to sense power levels without one. That's a nice Dragon Ball you've got yourself there. It would appear that you and I are after the same thing. <laughs> Fortunately for you, I have business to take care of before I take it. But I'd think twice before doing something stupid like running away if I were you. Huh? There you are. You've got some nerve, Vegeta. Ugh, thanks to foolish actions, Lord Frieza has lost faith in me. If you don't give me the location of the Dragon Balls this instant, I'll just have to beat it out of you. You're welcome to try. <laughs> you never learn, do you? <laughs> He's let his guard down. There's nowhere to run, Vegeta! <laughs> Sincerely hope you're ready for your trip to hell. Make me laugh. Don't be absurd. I have far more power than a savage like you. Believe it! Got it, God! Remember when I clung to life by a thread? You regret healing me now, don't you? Something to keep in mind. We Saiyans grow stronger every time we're brought to the brink of death. Uh, oh, yeah. That's 
right. Goku keeps getting stronger after each one of his fights. So, Baldy, what's it going to be? You forking over that ball, or am I taking it? Okay, if I give this to you, uh, do you promise just to take it and leave? <laughs> Fine, why not? There's no point in wasting my time with small fries like you once I have the Dragon Ball. Finally, I will be the one to rule over the universe, not that foolish Frieza! Immortality will be mine! <laughs> we can't just let him have all seven Dragon Balls! Come on, Gohan, we're counting on you! Whatever you do, don't let Vegeta find you! I hope Krillin and Bulma are okay. Better hurry! No one sees me, though. I'd better pick up my speed. Huh. This one has four stars. It's just like the one I... What's coming? Vegeta! I have to hurry up and hide. Where to hide? Where to hide? Where did this power come from all of a sudden? It's gone. What's going on here? Who's there? If you don't show yourself right now, I'll reduce this place to ashes! W wait It's only me! Well, if it isn't Kakarot's little brat... That's a Dragon Ball! Wait, where did you get that? It was a gift! From that follically challenged friend of yours. Krillin? You killed him, didn't you? No, he's alive. But I'd be more than willing to fix that if you'd like. Huh? And I think I'll let you live. Luckily for you, I'm feeling generous now that I've got all the Dragon Balls. All of them? Oh. Curious, sir. Uh... What's that you've got in your hand there? Oh, uh, this? It's a watch! With such primitive technology, I'm surprised you Earthlings managed to make it to a remote planet like this. If you're here, then that must mean Kakarot's here too. No, he isn't! Oh, I see. That's too bad. When you get back to Earth, Kakarot's something for me. The next time we meet, I'm going to turn Hish's planet into space dust! <laughs> oh, that was close! <laughs> Krillin! Go on! Krillin, look! Look what I found! Way to go, Gohan! We knew you could do it! Great job, Gohan! We better get out of here, and quickly. Vegeta now knows where to find us. Yeah, I know. I ran into him not too long ago. What? Fortunately, I was able to hide this ball well enough that he didn't find it. Oh, man. You're one lucky kid, you know that? That's enough. Let's get out of here. It's not here! Impossible! It's a straight shot from where that brat was to here and where the Earthling was before! But how? How did he find it? <sighs> that device he was holding... That wasn't a watch! Damn that little maggot! He took what is rightfully mine and will pay with his life! Hmm. 
No! They're gone! Those damn Earthlings, they have no idea who they're messing with! It's only a matter of time before they come after the six Dragon Balls I have at my disposal. And when they do, I'll make them regret ever having crossed me! Krillin and the others were able to secure one of the Dragon Balls from Guru, but it was quickly stolen by Vegeta. But thanks to Gohan's quick thinking, they were able to prevent Vegeta from getting his hands on all seven of them. Void Vegeta's wrath, the trio had to find a new place to hide. Krillin then made his way back to Guru with Gohan in tow. Freezes ace up his sleeve. The force. <laughs> no way! <sighs> what? Gotta make sure that Vegeta and the others don't find us. Right! are hiding all sorts of untapped power. I think I can handle this. I probably didn't fly too far. Hey, let's go. We got to Guru's place, okay? Hang in there, Gohan. It's not much longer till we reach Guru. Right! Huh? 
I did it! I think I can handle this. You're ready for a real challenge. Sensing great power. What? It, it, it's Vegeta. Gohan, I'm gonna buy us some time. You hurry on to Guru's place. Uh, okay. Hand over that Dragon Ball with the four stars on it, right? Now, or f consequences. What are you talking about? If you won't, I'll just have to make you. Astounding. Um, I heard you can unlock power. Indeed, there is something you have in great abundance, and you also bear some resistance towards it. A full awakening will require some effort. You quest into the power buried deep within you. Now, calm your mind and answer. Uh, okay. My boy, what do you think of great power? Yes, to you, power can be a force indeed. But that is not all. I sense you feel its full potential as well. Let us move on. Tell me, when should power abst? Correct. Power must be utilized only when necessary. The final question. Upon gaining power, for what purpose will you fight? No, that is not what you truly believe. Now then, once more. Upon gaining power, for what purpose will you fight? Yes, that is why you fight. Think only of this and relax. Okay. Now, I shall begin. What the? There's someone in there. That's where you've hidden the ball, isn't it? No! Wait, Vegeta! Don't! Get lost. There's no way I'm letting you inside. Do you want to die that badly? <laughs> Huge power level is inside. That must be Kakarot. So he is here after all. What the hell? It's you. Increase your power so much. 
I was to ask. Please let the others know there is a large unknown power source approaching the planet. What? Uh, of course! Uh, everyone! Grand Elder Guru says something is approaching the planet! Hey, it's gotta be Goku! Goku's finally... What? You really think so? It feels like there's more than one. More than one? Wait! That means... One, two, three, four, five. It's energy! Damn it, it has to be the Ginyu Force! I can't believe Frieza actually called the Ginyu Force! G you Give me the Dragon Ball right now! Are you insane? There's no way we're gonna give it to you! Just do it! I won't lay a finger on you once I'm immortal! You have my word! You think we're falling for that? Don't you get it? Each member of the Ginyu Force is just as strong as me! Maybe even stronger! And there are five of them! They'll hunt us down with their advanced scouters and kill every single one of us! There's only one way to beat them, and that's to give me the ball so I can wish for immortality! A Saiyan may be speaking the truth. There are indeed five evil power sources on their way. Uh, 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 but if we do this, then we came all the way out here for nothing! The Dragon Balls grant the user three wishes. You can still have your wish granted. Three? I thought we only got one wish! If I don't get my wish, then kiss your asses goodbye! Okay, fine. Follow us! But you had better keep your promise! This is crazy! Fly as fast as you can! So they finally arrived. I've been expecting you. Thank you, sir. Lord Frieza, we humbly await to carry out your orders. The traitorous Vegeta has stolen the Dragon Balls I've gone to great lengths to obtain. Make him suffer for his crime and then bring him... Hence... Spocation! Frieza! Scary! Thing. Time for our mission! Men, are you ready for this? To battle! <laughs> Bulma, no time to talk! We're taking the Dragon Ball! What? What's going on? Was that... Vegeta just now? Yeah. Damn it, they're on the move! This isn't good! They're so fast! I hope we can make it in time! Hurry, you fools!
Vegeta. They're fast. We didn't even see them coming. Damn it. We were so close. Oh? If I'm not mistaken, that's one of the Dragon Balls, isn't it? The five behind you? Plus the two you're holding? <laughs> that adds up to all seven! Yeah, and you're not getting your purple hands on them! Fine. We'll just have to take them from you then. Guldo! Sir! <laughs> How did he... <sighs> So that tubby four-eyed freak actually does have the ability to stop time. Not good. And that's all seven of them. All that's left is to finish you guys off. Vegeta, your suffering will be handled by me personally. Hey, not so fast, Captain. You got to have all the fun last time. Yeah, that's right. I suppose you're right. Fine. Raccoon, you take Vegeta. Guldo, you take the two kids. This should be interesting. Aren't I a great captain? Oh, oh, you're the best. Best. In the meantime, I'll deliver the Dragon Balls to Lord Frieza. And then he will finally be able to attain immortality! <laughs> so, Guldo, why don't you finish those pipsqueaks off first, huh? <laughs> this isn't fair. I'm gonna be done with this in no time! All right, here goes nothing. Release your power! <laughs> There's more to you runs than I thought. Storm, let's make this quick. Right. All right. Solar 
Ginyu's gonna have to come up with a new pose that the four of us can do. We did it! Yeah, if we can keep this up until Goku gets here, we should be okay. You two really are off on your own little world, aren't you? Guldo was nothing. He's the weakest of the bunch. The real suffering truly starts now. All right, Vegeta. Now. It's our turn to play. <laughs> you kids can play too if you want. <laughs> I'll play with all of you. Magnificent Captain Ginyu. I must admit, I'm impressed you were able to gather all seven Dragon Balls so quickly. There's no higher honor than such praise from you, Lord Frieza. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it is finally time to turn my dream of immortality into a reality. Let's begin, shall we? Dragon Balls! I command you to grant me immortality and eternal youth! Sir? Are you... are you immortal now? Uh, no. I suspect not. Ah, yes. There must be some sort of incantation to activate them. 
perhaps some sort of secret phrase that only the Namekians know. Seems I'll have to hunt down more of those worms. Oh? Look at that. I'm picking up three Namekian power signatures. It appears a few of them survived. Lord Frieza, if you would like, I can force the phrase out of them. No, I think I'll ask them myself. You'll do well to remember that I have experience dealing with these primitive creatures. Captain Ginyu, you stay here and keep watch over the Dragon Balls. Understood, Lord Frieza. I won't disappoint you. are nothing but a bunch of pushovers. Well, might as well put the three of you out of your misery. Huh? What was that? Where'd that spaceship come from? It's Goku. He, he finally made it. Attention, we have arrived on planet Namek. I gotta find those three fast. Please be alive, you guys. Please be safe. Goku's heroic arrival. Huh? Go on? And Krillin? They're in trouble! They're hanging on by a thread. They're really close. Right where those three huge powers are. I'm on my way, guys. Hang on. Thank you. 